Yes. Okay, so I just have to put a new ABS module in this Ford Escape. See, that's the old ABS module there. And here is the new ABS module. Well, new used ABS module all the way down here, bottom of the car there. See, it's all installed there, all bled and everything, all good. Now my ABS lights off and everything, but the ABS light was on after I replaced the module, even though it was on before because of no communication. Now it was on because of a VIN mismatch. I had a code in there for VIN mismatch, so the ABS was not going to work. Now, normally you would download the information from this old module into the scan tool here and then dump it into that new module there. But I was unable to do that because I couldn't communicate with it. So that was not an option. So what you have to do in that instance is you have to use something called as built data. And I'm going to throw it up on the screen. You can see there as I scroll up and down through it. As built data is the factory hexadecimal programming for these vehicles, for this, for this module. So I was able to enter that information into here when it prompted me to do so. And it programmed that ABS module in this forward escape here. And it can, I was able to complete the repair and get that light out. The system is bled and this car is now good to go. So that's just something that you might want to look into. I'll put it back up on the screen again there you go, so you guys can see it. It's Ford As Built Data, and I'll put the website up on the screen there for you too. But it's really, really useful when you're doing that programmable module installation and you can't get any information from the old computer because it's damaged or it's not communicating or it's just bad in a way that you can't download the information from it. So that's what you have to do. You have to use Ford As Built Data. And that's how I fixed this 2008 Ford Escape with, a Ford AB, with, uh, with an ABS module that would not communicate. We had a flashing ABS light, traction light on, just wasn't working at all. Now for a quick ride in the Ford Escape. And that bad boy is fixed, you can see. No ABS light. All done.